plus some fives. We've got a graph that I've just drawn out there from the book there. And the first part we're asked to modulus it. So the modulus of this, this negative bit here is going to flip up. So I'm just going to put that there. This point down here at minus four, minus five is going to flip up here to be minus four, five. But the rest of it is all the same. So it looks like this. Still crosses at three, still goes down there. And there's that graph. Part B, though, says find P of the modulus of X. So how I've been explaining this to you is that the positive part of here stays the same. So I'm just going to draw that. That point there is 2, 1. It still crosses here at 3. And then we want to flip this bit over to reflect it across. Something like that. So this point here now is at minus 2, 1. Um, but everything else has gone. That point there just doesn't exist in this part of the graph. This minus 8 we've lost because the minus 8 would be modulus to give 8 and 8 gives something up there. That's what we've got here. Minus 8 gives something up there. 